Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Bria. And first of all, I apologize for making everyone wait for me for so long. A lot of things has been happening for the past couple of months. That is why I have been absent for quite a while. I just wish to explain to you what has been going on. Um, I'm not sure. I believe I've mentioned before, if I haven't, I do apologize, but I was quite busy with a lot of stuff as my role as a maid of honor to my friend's wedding. So I was busy uh, planning her uh, bridal shower, planning the bachelorette party, and also the day of the wedding itself. Now for the wedding itself, um, it was quite simple, but the thing is, um, there's a bit of twist, um, cause, uh, my friend married to a Chinese family, a Chinese guy, so there'll be, so she is half Chinese and half white, so she is, so basically the whole wedding is split into two cultures, so the first part of the wedding day was us bridesmaids and the maid of honor get together and plan out, set up everything for the door game. Door game is traditional in Chinese wedding culture. Um, for those who are familiar with this, they, you guys will know. Um, so we had to plan that, buy the stuff that is necessary to give the boys a little challenge because there's the saying no pain no gain so the groom and his men has to go through the challenges it before they could get to the bride so that's what we did and then um after that we had to do the tea ceremony and then had to have some food and then head over to the ceremony itself after the ceremony lots of pictures and basically all of us were eaten alive by mosquitoes because it was outdoor in a reserve like like by the forest so mosquitoes are still around we were eaten alive i was lucky enough to only get a couple of mosquito bites but on my back um for some reason my face my the front part of my body and hands are safe to be fair i was quite a blood bank to the mosquitoes mainly because i received like quite a lot when i was in hong kong it was hell <laughs> so you know but other than that um after that we head to the reception i as the maid of honor had to help the brides change into the reception dress and also had to uh, be introduced and also do a speech. So it was quite nerve wracking, but overall it was fun in the end, really tired. Uh, all of us bridesmaids were up and about for almost 24 hours that day. So I was, we were quite tired. We pretty much passed out. <laughs> Because we had to wake up like 5 a.m. in the morning uh, for the makeup artist to come over do the makeup for us and everything. Like I said, it's quite a long day. Anywho, um, aside from that, um, the reason why I'm making this video is not just because it's explaining my situation, but also to explain the future of this channel. Um, as many of you have been following me, I've been doing tarot readings for quite a long while. Um, but I'm not sure about doing it anymore in the future. I will do one more. Um, but after that, um, probably not much in the future. Um, I have a couple of reasons. Um, so aside from the whole bridal uh, wedding situation, uh, the thing is, uh, my home was haunted, I guess it, I could say, by roughly 
five spirits. I say spirits, not ghosts. I respect because apparently ghosts, the word ghost is quite offensive from what I heard. It's better to call them spirits. But anywho, it's still. Um, the, how did that happen is because um, my complex was once uh, flooded because the pipe burst and because it's flooded it needs to be renovated clean and everything so my family had to live in a hotel for a couple of months for it to be finished and this gives the spirits a chance to come on in because it's empty and haunt the place we didn't know that we had to do some procedure before we enter the house but ever since we got back um Let's just say the environment, um, the atmosphere was quite negative. Um, also because uh, they seemed to like playing pranks on my mom because she's I'm not sure if she's um, if because of her OCD or not, but they've been leaving things around strands of lawn hair, not mine. On places that should not be there <laughs> basically they're playing pranks so it got my mom really paranoid um, that she seeks help in Hong Kong to have it rid of um, we were successful in apparently getting rid of four out of five one was stopped because there is a barrier around the house now, so but other than that, um it's not a joke. Uh if you let the if you leave it alone if your house or complex is haunted, so it'd be best to have it dealt with because it would uh, impact the atmosphere. You would get bad luck if it's not dealt with. And There are many cases, but I'm not going to get into that. It's going to be quite negative. But yeah, so because well, the, I'm not sure if there's still one here or not. I'm not sure, but if, it, if there is, I'm not going. To, I don't want to take any risk. Um, because Taoism is kind of a witchcraft, from what I gather. It, even though it's spiritual, but I don't want to take the risk. Just for everyone's safety. Not just mine, but everyone. So I hope you guys understood. But anywho, the future of this channel, I'm just going more dive into skincare and anime. I'm, I'm sure there's a lot of channels that's anime, but I may as well try. I do what I can um, to give you, keep you guys entertained or updated. I'm not really good at it, but I do try my best. But otherwise, I hope you guys will um, be patient with me. And as I go along in this journey, I do the best I could. Um, I hope you guys understood. So without further ado, um, I hope you guys will continue to watch over me, grow with me, so yeah, anyways, I'll see you guys next time, take care, bye-bye.